Hey, it's me, this is the Tree, and welcome back to another Manulux tutorial. Today, we're going to work on an uptime command for your bot. So, to get started, I already created the basic layout of a command. We've done that multiple times now, so you should know how this goes. For the invoke, I'm just gonna set it to uptime, and the help will be. shows the current uptime of the bot. So first off, in our handle method, we need to get the runtime MX bean. And to obtain the runtime MX bean, we simply type runtime MX bean. We call it runtime MX bean. And we're gonna say management factory dot get runtime mx bean and what we can do with the runtime mx bean is get the uptime of the program and the uptime of the program is returned in a long what we can do is long uptime e is equal to runtime mx bean dot get uptime and if we look at the get uptime method you see that it returns the uptime of the java virtual machine aka the jvm in milliseconds so what we need to do first is get the uptime in seconds which is just basic math then that's just to, to divide the uptime by 1000 to get to the number of hours that the machine has been running we have the uptime in seconds we divide it by 60 times 60 and of course to get the number of minutes we take the uptime in seconds divided by 60 and subtract the number of hours times 60. I don't know the math behind this, but it works. And of course, we need to get the number of seconds, which is which we do by having the uptime in seconds, and we modulo this by 60, because there are 60 seconds in one minute. Next up, we're going to send a message to the channel, and for that, we're going to use a method that we haven't used before. So what we're gonna do first is use to get the normal stuff. So event.getChannel. Next up, we need to say send message format. And this is a special method that just does a string.format underwater. I mean, if you look at it, it literally, it literally does send message format in the arguments. So what we can do in here, we can say my uptime is, and I'm gonna do a little bit of markdown formatting. We're gonna say placeholder, hours another placeholder for the minutes and another placeholder for the seconds and you can probably see why i'm using send message format as this will make our code look way cleaner than just having to concatenate on every time so what we can do here is say number of hours number of minutes and and number of seconds. Last but not least, we're gonna queue this off and register it in our command manager. And as you can see, I'm keeping the music commands separated from all the other commands. And I'm doing this to have like a little bit of grouping in how I add the commands. So now that our command is registered, let's start the bot and go over to Discord. So now that our bot has started up, we're gonna wait a while. So right now I've waited a while, and if we type J explanation mark up time, as you can see the uptime is zero hours, one minute and 58 seconds. You can of course add the days in here as well, but for the simplicity of this tutorial, I kept it with hours, minutes and seconds. So if you liked this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. And I see you guys in two weeks with another Manuduck tutorial. Bye! Wait, before I forget, let's completely annihilate the channel. Nice and clean for the next tutorial. Bye! Yeah, that body's a blessing, girl. I ain't trying to pressure her. With the temperature, I wrote the song, but I am the messenger through the metropolis. There is no stopping this. Flowers and kisses, yeah. I heard you like chocolate. Light up the candles.